Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup routine. Um, and it's really easy and simple. I mean, as you can see, there's not much going on, but it just is like the perfect amount of makeup, I think. But um, yeah, so I kind of have to do my makeup really quickly, especially um, if Harlow's awake because obviously she needs my full attention. Um, so I kind of have to like rush and do it. So I found a good like makeup routine that I can do in I think like 10 minutes, honestly, um, is what it takes. And I used to like take like an hour on my makeup, but now that I'm a mom, I can't do that. So yeah, this is just my everyday makeup routine that I do for like work and when school starts again, then I'll do it for school or just if I feel like putting on makeup that day. Um, usually I don't, but yeah, this is it. So if you want to see how I do my makeup every day, just keep watching. So first I'm going in with some rose spray to prime my face. And I just spray that all over and dry it a little bit. Um, I like that just because... My skin gets a little bit oily, but I can't seem to find a good primer that I like for it, so I just use that spray and it helps. Um, now I'm doing the Too Faced Born This Way foundation, and I'm just putting that all over, and then I'm going to blend it out with a beauty blender, a damp one, of course, I think it helps a lot if it's damp. Then I'm using the Jeffree Star Concealer, and I'm going to put it under my eyes, and everywhere that the sun hits so I put it down the bridge of my nose and then fan it out between my eyebrows and then my cupid's bow and then my chin and then a little bit around my nose just to do a little bit more highlighting and then I'm gonna also blend that out with a beauty blender as well And then I'm going to use the Too Faced Born This Way um, setting powder, and it's just the translucent shade. And I'm going to use my beauty sponge to apply it under my eyes. And then everywhere that I put the concealer, I'm going to set with the powder with the beauty sponge. And then I'm going to set the rest of my makeup with a brush in the same powder. I always just do that because I feel like it helps set the under eyes better when I use the beauty sponge and it doesn't crease. Um, then I'm going to use the Park Princess Tarte Contouring Palette and I'm going to use the shade, I think it's called Angle, and then I'm just going to put it right under my cheekbones and everywhere that I want to contour. So. Um, I did my forehead too. And then I'm going to use this Wet n Wild Rose Champagne Blush. I think it's a really pretty natural color and I use it every day. And then I'm going to use a Laura Mercier Highlighting Palette and I'm just going in with the middle shade. It's just a gold champagne color shade. And then I'm going to put that on um, my cheekbones and my brow bone and the bridge of my nose and my cupid's bow and it adds a really good highlight it's natural it's not too much and I think it helps a lot and then I'm using the rose spray again all over my face to set my face and then I'm using the Anastasia Brow Wiz in the shade taupe and I cut that part out because it takes me a long time to do my brows but basically I just filled them in and there's not really much to it. I just brush them up and then fill in any sparse areas. Nothing too crazy. And then I'm going in with the Kula SPF setting spray and this has sunscreen in it. So I use that last and then I'm using the Buxom um, mascara and that's it. I just coat my lashes.